Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for tuning in. I'm adding the option of winning RP instead of the gaming headset and mouse for first and second place winners. You can win RP yourself just by participating in my comment question at the end of the video. Starting off the countdown for episode 8 is Triblin playing as Rymus, who has spotted activity at the dragon with a ward. The enemy team is pushing mid and bot while three are taking dragon. Purple is nowhere nearby, so it's all down to Rymus, and he will not get there in time to smite steal, being interrupted on the way by Yi, but still ults and taunts him right back to him. No Mon in Italy is caught as well for the double kill. Nocturne seeing this going bad starts running towards mid lane and Xin Zhao trying to escape but a powerball explodes in close proximity finishing Nocturne off with an auto attack. Talon ults and silences Xin Zhao, giving assistance to Ramus who shields and taunts. Now seeing Zipper join the fight, Talon ignites with Ramus skin in the quad, and now Xin Zhao is all that's left. Talon retreats, almost dying with a Lux shield helping. No team member attempts to steal the last kill. Great work, the lol community seems to be getting better and better, and it's because of humble players like these guys. Ramus gets the Penta kill, of course. Fourth place, this episode is reserved for Teemo in the top lane of this almost even game. Purple has four Mia and two blue are bot, so an engagement on the push lane top is unquestionable incoming. Teemo has many shrooms placed and Amumu comes out of the tri brush to get silenced with Teemo placing a shroom down in front of Garen. Now the other three flank from the river, singes beeline and straight for a flip. Teemo flashes and Brand gets flinged into his demise getting a pillar off. Garen is also trapped but Singe hits a shroom and four are affected and Cat will jump into the other one blowing up in their faces. Teemo begins his offensive push going after Jace who wasn't affected but will jump back into him. He will dart and continue auto attacking while Jace keeps missing and the Yodel claims a quintessimation utilizing a couple of destructive mushrooms. Continuing the countdown at number 3 is Disconnected playing as Brand. Both teams are positioning themselves for a team fight with Shen being able to ult in at any time. Tark stuns Leona who places a ward in the river. GP boosts morale but is stunned and bursted instantly by LeBlanc. Brand misses Pillar and cuts back from Amumu allowing Olaf to tank with Shen uniting in. Amumu curses but Brand will barely dodge it landing Pyroclasm on Trist and a stun come on Amumu with the ult bouncing five times between Riven and Trist for the first kill. Following up with a Pillar, Brand secures the triple kill. He ignites LeBlanc keeping the autos going but Riven jumps in from the shadows stunning them both but seer and a few hits will give the quad being shielded by Shen. He will continue chasing LeBlanc, placing a pillar perfectly getting her low. She's trying to escape but Brand walks straight under the tower finishing off LeBlanc with conflagration giving the blue team a much more comfortable lead. And entering in at second place is Cubot, playing as firefighter Tristana who is keeping it low while her team is pushing purple side bot. Leona will try to engage but misses and is slowed, launching solar flare, clipping Twitch. Trist will explosive shot and get the final tick for kill number one. Twitch is getting focused by Garen with Graves jumping into combo. Inu goes down to the might of Demacia and unveils a frozen wasteland with Fiddle's Crow Storm comboing. Trist will rocket jump in, slam into the three, ulting Garen in the face. She will beep pop combo and jump into the Katarina for the well-timed and well-played Quintessimation with just enough mana to pull it off. Joining us at the first place slot is Miser Men, who is bum-rushing Dragon with his team to come in the assistance of Blue Team. Amumu bandages in, catching Shaco, Corky, Valkyries, Nunu ults, Curse is launched with Zig's mine and charge combo exploding, placing Kale and Blitz exactly onto two mines for the double. Absolute Zero does good damage and he follows on Amumu for the triple. One bouncing bomb into the vein with an auto attack gets the revenge. Quadra now being faced solely by the tanky Jarvan. Ziggs does not bitch out and he keeps his focus landing autos and another bomb dropping to below 50 health. Ziggs will survive and claim his well positioned Quintessimation. As the bonus Pentakill plays, I want to remind you that you can submit your own LOL replay files of Pentakills, Pentasteals, I bet you all have a lot of those, WTF moments, glitches, and pro plays to our website, thebuttonmashers.com. The link is below the video. If you don't have LOL replay, get it. Last video's winners were chosen at random from the comment section, and they are Asian Fail from Canada and Gbags Vid from the UK. Congrats, you now have the option of a gaming mouse or $20 in RP. Congrats to everyone for being placed. Miserman and Cubot, to claim your prizes, contact me on LOL by reading the instructions in the description. If you want to win $20 in RP for yourself, answer this question. Should dihydrogen monoxide, which is known to be lethal, be labeled as a dangerous substance to keep people safe? Answer the question down below in the comments section. Don't forget to subscribe and kindly rate the video. Have a very nice day. My name is Jerry. Swoosh!